last but not least, we're going to think about the shoulders, but also again between our shoulder blades here. A really handy piece of kit to leave in your office is one of these. You can get them on Amazon online, very easy. And with this, we're going to hold the band. If you, if you want it a bit lighter, you can hold it by a single. If you want it a bit stiffer, you can hold it with two. So we're going to stand up nice and tall. We're going to have the hands just below shoulder height, and then we're going to separate the band. Okay, you can see here my head stays nice and level. We're going to feel the back of the shoulder blades rotating and squeezing. Again, one thing that's really important here is to avoid arching your back. So keep a nice neutral spine, pulling the shoulders apart. You should feel energy and fatigue around the back of the shoulders, so in between the shoulder blades. And 10 to 15 repetitions is a good guide. A couple of times you can do two sets. And again, something you can repeat throughout the day. Going back to our massage gum, we can use that to get into the deltoid muscle and the, the pecs. One stretch I really like is applying tension with the gun to the front of the shoulder and taking the arm through big range of movement backwards. So we're doing the opposite to what you've been doing all day. So it's a really good stretch, again, in that position. Another exercise we can do are some wall angels here. So any wall works. Have your back pressed up against the wall. And again, our head as well. Everything is neutral. We're gonna bring our elbows and hands to touch the wall. And we're gonna press slowly up to a point where we don't feel ourselves cheating and leaving the wall. So for me, that's my top range. Keeping good form, keeping all of my back in contact with the wall. 